gender gap persists at the top of academe. While one in two academics are female, only one in five of them makes it to professor, and that drops to one in six when it comes to medicine. That is why, unashamedly, the Academy of Medical Sciences has launched a scheme to support the career progression of female scientists and clinicians, SUSTAIN. SUSTAIN attracted 20 women to its pilot scheme. They were at an early career stage, but all had been awarded fellowships. The aim of SUSTAIN was to provide support and training to enable their research careers to thrive so they could progress to leadership roles. I was uh, trained as a mechanical engineer. I did my PhD in Australia, uh, in Sydney, primarily on structural biology. I'm a clinical trainee in plastic and reconstructive surgery. I do cell and matrix biology as applied to progressive kidney disease. I'm looking to see how immune cells and viruses actually interact in the liver microenvironment. I'm um, a consultant in paediatric endocrinology. SUSTAIN was designed to use a variety of approaches to personal development. These included co-coaching, mentoring, media training, and a series of developmental workshops. These were hugely successful and covered topics such as grant writing and how to build a successful research team. So SUSTAIN has addressed issues of self-confidence, presentational skills, and support. We hope that the benefits Sustain has brought will help this fantastic group of women in their life and leadership journey. I'm very um, privileged that I'm part of this pilot cohort of only 20 women. But there are many, many more women in the UK that have promising uh, careers and have independent fellowships as well. Clearly, Sustain has shone a light on what needs to be done to support and nurture women so they can become the leaders of tomorrow. We have um, come together from different backgrounds, basic science and clinical uh, academics, and we are finding that we have such diverse experiences, mothers in science, uh, people that have just started their careers, and it's critical because it's rescuing high quality researchers from um, abandoning research really is such a key point in their careers. It has been absolutely fantastic. Um, I, you know, I can't rate the SUSTAIN programme highly enough to be honest.